Hello everyone, welcome to my vlog. Uh, so happy to be back and uh, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day so far. Um, as I mentioned last time, uh, we are starting beauty product reviews uh, and I hope you enjoyed my last vlog and you found it interesting and helpful when it comes to finding that perfect primer and especially focusing on Guerlain Meteorites Pearls Light Diffusing Primer. Today, uh, obviously, as a makeup lover, uh, there is uh, a product that is essential in our everyday makeup routine, which is obviously foundation. There is so many different foundations on the market, and honestly, throughout the years, I've been testing so many of them, uh, trying to find the one that uh, works best for me. Uh, the thing is, uh, with age and with time your skin changes as well so even though you might find this perfect foundation for yourself at some point uh, after a few years it might not work the same way for you so make sure be always open and make sure that um, uh, you check um, you might ask the beauty consultant at the beauty counters uh, ask for the advice maybe they can do a uh, free makeup consultation when they can actually advise you on what's new on the market um, and what might work for you at this point um, uh, Probably 10 years ago, that was the time when I uh, discovered a foundation that worked for me at that time just perfectly. And that was Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation. Uh, it looks like this. And it's actually after 10 years, during that time, I've been changing the foundations, uh, testing. I found my favorite ones and I think I will have a chance to uh, feature them uh, as well at some point but after 10 years I got back to it because I felt my skin needs a change my, uh, my skin uh, needs a change and uh, I am a lover of full coverage. Uh, Estee Lauder uh, Double Wear Foundation, it claims to be number one uh, makeup uh, foundation uh, by the brand. Uh, it's actually, it says it's medium coverage, but it's boldable, um, uh, which means you can apply a few layers depending on uh, what kind of coverage you're looking for. Um, it uh, claims to be a long wear, um, up to 15 hours uh, power stay um, with uh, as I said, um, medium coverage, uh, uh, semi matte finish. However, I found it, it's actually quite covering. I wouldn't say it's medium, I would say it's actually high coverage, but as I said, because it's buildable, you can apply a few layers and that way you can create um, a stronger, more. Um, uh, more coverage. Um, uh, it claims to be also uh, um, lightweight and it does feel, although it is uh, I would say medium to high coverage, it is. Uh, it doesn't feel that way. Like some foundation I found uh, when they are like full coverage, you feel like wearing a mask on your face. With this one, actually it feels uh, so good and you don't even feel that you're wearing makeup. So it's definitely lightweight formula and um, it won't smudge. And what it's uh, what I really like about this foundation is that it doesn't change its color du uh, during the day. So you sometimes uh, feel when you wear the foundation for so many hours, it actually gets darken, uh, darker uh, throughout the day because of the heat. Uh, with this one, it uh, it stay in place um, uh, without uh, even you know with the humidity, with the heat, uh, or with being active, it stay in place. Uh, definitely, uh, the the foundation it claims to be uh, oil free, and it is oil free. Dermatologist tested as well as um, uh, it's fragrance free. So for those of you who are um, very allergic to scents or very sensitive this might be a great option um, so it's stay in place and um, it comes in a 30 ml bottle um, and uh, I believe right now it's 38 shades 
that's amazing i don't know um any other foundation that has so many shades so i i'm sure you will find the color that will match uh, your skin just perfectly uh, and the price point is actually very reasonable when it comes to foundation it's uh, uh about 40 dollars so uh for 30 mil 40 dollars and uh remember a small amount goes a long way so we don't really need a lot and as I said, if you are looking for more coverage, then you can add a little bit more product. So um, uh, definitely one of my favorite. It's the one that I'm using right now. The one thing it is that unfortunately um, I don't like it is the fact that um, because I'm also very concerned about my skin, uh, I've been told to use mineral foundation and it's not your minerals uh, there's no minerals in here so um, as much as your skin looks flawless and beautiful it doesn't breathe so um, it might be a great uh, foundation for going out uh, for special events special evenings out but if you're wearing makeup every day that might not be a product if you're uh, for you if you're very um, skin focused uh, person so just keep that in mind and uh, yeah so I hope you will find uh, this uh, review useful uh, always feel free to send me um, uh, messages or emails to uh, uh, to my email uh, abasak at fashioncalgary.ca I'm all also on uh, social media Twitter Instagram uh, Facebook and I look forward to see you next time